everyone, this is Meg from the Concord Public Library Children's Room. It's almost Easter, and at my house, Easter brings lots and lots of peeps. While I do enjoy the gooey, marshmallowy goodness of peeps, I just can't eat too many of them, and I usually have lots of leftover peeps. So today, I'm going to show you a couple of fun experiments that you can do at home with your leftover peeps. But because these experiments involve the microwave oven and heat, the peeps will get pretty hot, so I want you to make sure to ask an adult to help you with your experiments. To get started, let's gather these supplies. So you're going to need peeps, and you can use either bunnies or chicks or a combination of both, and you can use any color that you want. I have pink, yellow, and blue sorted peeps here. And then you're going to need a microwave safe plate like an uncoated paper plate or you could use a little glass plate, some toothpicks, an empty water bottle, and we are going to cut the water bottle at the first line. So you want to go ahead and cut that down. And then you, for another experiment you're going to need a, like a little pie plate or some kind of a plate that's raised up so that you won't have to worry about water leaking all over the place. So for our first experiment, we're going to see what happens when we heat our peeps in the microwave oven. I'm going to take a couple of peeps. I'm going to do a pink bunny and a yellow chick. And I want you to think for a minute about what will happen when we add heat. Do you think they'll shrink or are they going to grow larger? Let's find out. Okay, we're going to start by putting our peeps in the microwave oven. Set your timer to 30 seconds and start. Then watch what happens. Oh my gosh, they're getting really big. Did you guess right? Did you say that your peeps were going to expand? Just look how big those peeps are. My goodness. Then just watch for a little bit while they cool down. Are they going to shrink again? What do you think? So what's the science behind it? Peeps, like other marshmallows, are basically thousands of teeny tiny air bubbles surrounded by thin walls of gelatin and sugar syrup. So if you take one of your peeps and look at side view, you can see a bunch of tiny little holes. When they're microwaved, the water molecules in the syrup begin to vibrate and heat up. They quickly turn to steam and fill the air pockets in the marshmallow, causing them to expand. That's why you see your peeps grow. Okay, and now just for fun, I'm going to have you take a couple of peeps. I've got two checks. And we're going to put a toothpick in each one. You're going to have them facing each other. And then we're going to heat them up in the microwave and see what happens. Now we're going to put the chicks in the microwave oven. Set your timer for 20 seconds. Start and watch what happens. Can you see the little sticks moving? It looks like they're having a peep sword war. Okay, mm -hmm. so for our next experiment, we're going to take our empty water bottle and you're going to stuff it with bunnies. So you're going to put your bunnies down in side by side, as many as you can get in there. It looks like this bottle's going to hold four. Go ahead and stuff them down in there. Okay. And then we're going to take them to the microwave. So we're going to put our bottle in the microwave oven. Start your timer for one minute. And watch. <gasps> oh my gosh! Not only are they expanding, it's like a geyser. Wow, that's really cool. I 
don't think we need any more time. 30 seconds was long enough. Let's stop and watch. Oh my gosh, and now it's all shrinking back down again. Wow, it was like lava. Now that should be pretty hot, so I wouldn't touch that yet. Let it cool for a little bit before you touch it. For our last experiment, let's find out what happens when we get our peeps wet. We'll place colorful peep chicks in a circle in a pie plate or another waterproof plate. Then we're going to pour water in the center until the peeps are partially covered. And then just let them sit and watch and see what happens. Can you see the colors starting to run? They're all running in toward the center. You can see some yellow, some blue, there's some pink. The pink is really going in pretty quickly. So what's the science behind this? And what is this called? So many of the foods that you eat are colored with artificial dye. Some of the dyes will easily dissolve in water. This means that when the foods containing the dye are placed in water, the molecules that make up the dye will break away from the food and start to spread out in the water. This process where the molecules spread out like this is called diffusion. Look at all the pretty colors. Well, that was fun. Thank you for joining me for my peeps experiment. I hope you had as much fun as I did. See you next time.